so hi everyone today i will be talking about a very interesting library that i have recently figured out that is faker so basically there was a problem certain that I was working on for which i was trying to get some data set from the internet eventually i couldn't find it out uh, so then i came to know about this particular library faker that can help you generate a numerous fake data for any of your projects now this can be of a great help when you are going for some unit testing while building out some real world project uh, for your company or eventually when you're trying out some experimental uh, projects, some experimental neural networks, some experimental problem statement for which you require data. So here we'll be looking into how Faker can be used to generate a number of uh, categories of data that includes company, names, dates, emails, and whatnot. So let's get started. So first of all, you need to pip install Faker. Uh, once you're able to pip install, we would be importing Faker uh, and eventually initialize the object with Faker. Then here uh, in this particular case, I'm trying to generate 100 samples for a user. Now in this particular case, uh, what I've done is that I have considered all the fake data categories that it can generate. So here you can see that the name, company, number. Now in number, you can see that digit is equal to 10. You can make it as 20 also, you can make it as 30 also. So depending upon the digit, it will be generating fake data for numbers. Word, it can generate fake, num uh, fake words, fake date, email, phones domain username favorite uh, color job profile credit card number urls file path country city state zip code address latitude longitude image url paragraph sentences booleans and random elements so like taking an uh, option from given elements present in the list so the, if you look into all the fake information that it can provide it is majorly around a single user information so if you want to create something around a user, uh, you are trying to test some code around some user data, Faker can be of great help and it can generate numerous amount of data. It's not like it is also limited to something. So if you look into the sample data set that we have generated now, for 100 uh, users, this is the num. This is the sample data set. Name, company, you can see the number. It is quite, looks quite genuine. The email ID here, you can see that. Phone numbers are generated domain is mentioned username is mentioned favorite color is there midnight blue silver and whatnot so there are 28 columns that we have generated right now the choice column if you remember it took uh, on uh, it took three values as an option and i'm randomly assigned values to it sentences have been provided some boolean values have been provided so you can make it as whether he smokes and profile photo urls are there again everything is fake nothing is working but it can be of great help when you're going for some sort of a unit testing or when you're trying to experiment something, uh, some code where you wish to have a quick uh, a small data set to work on.